Mina, Konbanwa, Jesus Freaking Gamer here, coming at you with more Deuteronomy. Surprise, surprise. Chapter 26, going to start with verse 6. But the Egyptians mistreated us, afflicted us, and laid hard bondage on us. Then we cried out to the Lord God of our fathers, and the Lord heard our voice, and looked on our affliction, and our labor, and our oppression. So the Lord brought us out of Egypt with a mighty hand, and with an outstretched arm, with great terror, and with signs and wonders. I want to see the word both there, but we don't want to add to the scripture, do we? <laughs> yeah. um, anyway, for those of you who got that joke, two thumbs up for you. The focus I want from these verses, I'm going to reference you all the way back to Genesis. Well, and actually at the beginning of Exodus as well, when we look at what God told Abraham, that the people that would be Abraham's children one day would suffer bondage for a long time and when I, I honestly forget exactly where it is Google is your friend or Strong's Exhaustive Concordance if you use the King James Version I use the King James I use the New King James and I use Strong's with the King James to cross check the New King James and anyway I'm off topic here and it's supposed to be a short video anyway point here the Lord heard their cries and he delivered them 400 years later. I don't know, it just seems to me that sometimes what the Lord thinks is good timing, we don't necessarily think it's good timing. It's like, okay, God, uh, watches are usually on your left hand, aren't they? We're going to pretend they are. Not that watches are used anymore. Anyway, off topic again. Gosh, uh, God, um, I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Still waiting. Oh, that that was that was a, a ow. That was a whip on my back. Yeah, I'm still now. It's an ow. A, a good time, God, to come in and uh, intervene. Really, God's arm wasn't short for the 400 years when He did not deliver them. He did have a plan. He did have a purpose, and His timing isn't always ours. Just thought I'd bring out an actual biblical example. You hear that a lot. It's a little bit cliched at this point, but biblically, very, I'm pointing at my Bible, very, very true. I love you guys very much. God bless.